Welcome to Kindle Love Stories. We're here today with romantic suspense author Jane Ann Krentz. Jane has written over 50 New York Times bestsellers, and I'm not saying 50 books, 50 New York Times bestsellers. I'm a huge fan. Oh, thank you. That makes me feel better. <laughs> <laughs> you are so good at writing romance. What do you think is romantic? How do you define romance? I think romance has to be founded on kindness. I think if there isn't kindness between two people, there's nothing else of value that's going to come out of that relationship. So if I had to come up with one word, I would say kindness. What I love about your writing and I love about romantic suspense is your heart is beating in two different ways and you get your happily ever after. I grew up on Nancy Drew, what can I say? <laughs> to me that's the perfect story, the romance and the suspense. Everything that happens in the plot in terms of the romance has to make something happen in terms of the suspense and vice versa. They plot in lockstep and I think that's putting together the best elements of those two genres. Genres ebb and flow and I think right now romantic suspense is is on a high tide. Oh, I'm, yeah. I'm excited about that. Hot, hot, hot. Yeah, I think so. What would you be doing if you were not a writer? I think if I hadn't gotten this really great gig as a writer, I probably would have tried to open a restaurant and the restaurant would have failed spectacularly because I would have emphasized healthy food <laughs> and the last thing anybody really wants to think about when they go out to dinner is a healthy meal. <laughs> so, so I would have been a failure as a restaurateur, I'm afraid, but that's probably what I would have tried. No, I think the tide has turned. I think people would be clamoring for your restaurant. No, 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 it's fried. If, well, you, want to, oh. if you want to succeed in the restaurant business, you've got, to, you've got to have fat and fry. I'm sorry. Do you have a favorite recipe? Well, I'm very hot on Brussels sprouts. I have an excellent roast, roasted Brussels sprouts recipe. Come to my website anytime. I'll be happy to give it to you. I wonder if you have any advice that you would give to your younger self about love. I think look deep is what I would say. Don't be distracted by the superficial. I know it sounds simple and it's old fashioned, but love is something that needs a really firm foundation to grow on. And that is not always apparent. On first meeting. Give it a chance. Don't make a hasty decision. Give it a chance and see if something can grow. We're going to be talking to best-selling author Jane Ann Krentz all week, so go to our Facebook page or kindlelovestories.com to see our fabulous conversations.